Hey guys, welcome to set 7. <laughs> I'm just rolling these out, you know. <laughs> um, I did some things off screen, not a lot, really. <laughs> all I really did was, um, upgrade. I now have an entire Vanquisher set. They're all not the same diff level, but they're all, you know, there. Which is the best armor I can currently have, so... Wicked. Also, boom. Epic. Okay. Um, reason why I'm here, actually, is to talk to him. I came here while, um, to buy the rest of the set, and he has something to say about the City of the Dead, so let's hear it. What can you tell me about the City of the Dead? I have never been inside its walls, and never will, so long as I draw breath. is a place for wayward souls. All was until the fall of man. What changed? Once the screams of the dead echoed from the city and across the plains. But now, the city is silent. And only the echoes remain. Disturbing. So let's go and check it out. I'll further further explore these type of things later. <laughs> this area later. I start to find one more of the um, bloodless. No clue where he is. It's probably in here somewhere. Ah, <laughs> <coughs> uh, you soul swear the. Yeah, I know. Does he use it now? Apparently I do. That's awesome. Never thought of that happening. Or it being used like, used like that. <laughs> also, I found something interesting at the uh, Tree of Life slash Death. Um... If you look at the portals, I'm gonna stand here so I kiss a cutscene triggers. But um, if you stand near the portals, there are actually um, statues erected dep depicting on what that world is. Like the maker actually has makers and whatnot. There's not much, you know, importance. It's just interesting. Onward. <laughs> yeah, it's me. Bam.
die. There we are. Oh yeah, and I renamed this to Axe Kai as Axe, like I usually do. <laughs> okay. And now I gotta find a way up there. Oh, hello. Almost missed you. Book of the Dead. Oh. Did I get too far? <laughs> so if I get too far away, I have that problem. Okay, cool. Good to know. Excuse me. I was just trying to wonder the range. <coughs> awesome. chest on my map. Of course. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you know, I always thought there'd be more references to death in this world. I mean, it is technically his world. Well, not his, but you know. He has the most influence over it. I wonder. No. Damn. I keep forgetting I can't run up skulls. What the frick is that? Which opens whatever the hell that is. It's a floating tray. I wonder. Ah. Genius. I like using the purple one. So 
something I can carry around myself. Give me greater, you know. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No. Start pulling it. that purpose. <laughs> Even his... Oh, that's awesome. So that's a car to carry around the Statue of Death. I'm loving this ability more and more. It'd be really cool, I'm not sure if they actually did it because I can't test it out, but it'd be really cool if they actually added a function where if you plug in the second controller, another person can play as the other death. Uh, someone... If, you, if you're able to, try that out. Um, I don't have a second controller, so I can't do it. Um, if you can, please tell me if it, if it is possible, because that would be just so awesome on so many different levels. Wait, I wonder. There's a statue down there. Guess this is all just to get this this box. Aha! This makes a good uh, test scapegoat, you know? If there's something you don't like down here, you just, you know, pop back to your body. Again. Happy accident. <laughs> <laughs> 